The hunt is on for those responsible for stealing dozens of bronze medallions from an Indiana cemetery. Police say around 40 flag holders were ripped from the graves of our nation's veterans. One America's Bobby Dupree has more. Outrage across an Indiana community after dozens of veteran flag holders are stolen from a local cemetery. Officials in LaPorte were shocked to discover 40 bronze emblems attached to American flags missing from graves at Patton Cemetery. The holders were ripped from their designated spots, flags just thrown on the ground. You can't get more disrespectful than actually taken from a gravesite for someone who served their country. Each emblem is said to cost up to $40 and are unique to a veteran's grave. A sign of respect, they're meant to honor military veterans and those who served as a public servant, like a police officer or firefighter. They're usually purchased by family members and nowadays it's hard to find a replacement. And for somebody to come and take those emblems that were there, put there by the different organizations and steal them and probably scrap them for money. You know, we have no idea, but it's really sad that it's come down to where they have to start doing stuff like that. According to authorities, the flag holders could have been stolen as far back as the 18th. They've yet to bring in a suspect, but local residents hope they find those responsible. You know, it's, it's a shame because because these people have fought a war for us. Um, they gave up their lives for us. And it's, it's a shame. And they should be caught and punished. This isn't the first time this has happened. Back in 2015, over four dozen grave markers were stolen from the same cemetery. Officials think it might not even be the emblems the thieves want, but the stakes that hold them in place, saying they're valuable to scrappers. For this few cents you get out of this brass rod, when you throw this medallion away, you're not hurting uh, me as an individual, but you're hurting uh, veterans' families. In the meantime, the LaPorte Police Department is on the hunt for the stolen markers and say they're still holding out hope. This is something that families like to do to honor their veterans, and we'd like to get those items back for them. Bobby Dupree, One American News. Want to see more videos like this? Click on the link below and subscribe to One American News on YouTube and call your cable provider and kindly demand that One American News is added to your lineup. Call and subscribe today.